So sorry about that, guys. I was trying to see how it looked like inside. It's like a whole floor, so I'm not I'm not going inside the whole floor. I thought it was gonna be a door, and I was gonna do a video about a door, and that's it. But I'm not doing that. I'm not that type of guy. I went up there. I said, "Oh, it's a whole floor. I'm gonna go back downstairs." So I just saw the I saw what it looks like from the elevator, and I came back down. So back forward, like I said, no one I, I can never take it serious. A person like that seriously would come in a situation like this. That when they help, when they fund it for a budget, that's gonna fund stuff like organizations like this. Now I'm not here to disparage a nonprofit. But the thing is, when you're when you're trying to the, the, the rally against something, but you refuse to call the right thing out because of you scared of not getting discretionary money for your your but your district because everybody has that for you, then I, I can never take it seriously and I can't support it. So like unless you're ready to call the nonprofits, it's hard to take it seriously. And especially you voted for the budget. You know what I mean? You voted for the budget, but then you get mad that stuff like this is happening, this organization get funded. And make the roads and your local menas and all these organizations get funded. Um, your worker justice projects, your NYICs, your um, nice for workers, and all the other organizations. It's really tough to take it seriously now. I don't really care. They're here. You know, it's what it is. You know, Biden did what he did. You guys voted Biden. That's on y'all. Y'all vote. Y'all get what y'all vote for. So, other than that, a lot of a lot of this migrant stuff is like a photo op, and I don't really care. I care about the migrants not get hit by a car or get hit by a truck like this because they're selling stuff on the, on the highway. That's what I care about. That's what I care about. I care about when the migrant kids are selling on the, on the subway with no adult supervision and we got pedophiles out there running around New York City. But these are the same people that love praising that film sound for freedom but they won't say anything about the kids on the trains selling candy on the train by themselves though so migrants sell kids on candy by, the, by themselves and the pet and, and and there's no real adult supervision they won't say anything about that that's why i tell them to take, take certain people real seriously when it comes to the migrant issue in new york state in new york city because they silent about these people hopping the border right all these people not fully illegal they love saying the word illegal immigrants i think it's stupid to say that word they real sight. They real vocal about that stuff. They real vocal. They real vocal. But when it comes to like situations like the kids on the on the trains selling stuff, selling fruits on the trains with no no supervision, opening up to pedophiles because it's sound freedom film. What we want to call it? They get, they they all horny about that. They they know where to be found. Or when the migrants sell it on places, they, they they'll be on the street like this selling candy. The migrant mothers holding the kids behind their back. Sell a candy on the train on, on the on the dangerous highways. They won't say anything about that. So, like, don't expect me to be at these fights about the migrants because it's nothing we can really do. I I love people. There's no such thing as a legal human being. And don't say that. Oh well, you didn't. Yeah, I spoke to Shahana Neef and team about that situation. I have a video of me being outside Shahana Neef's office talking to her off her team about the situation, about the kids selling stuff on the train with no adult supervision, and the migrants be on the streets of New York City, all over New York City, selling, selling candy, risking their lives. So I'm out here. But hey, the one of your organizations, they, they part of it. But if you're not ready to call this stuff out, then you ain't calling out shit. You just care about photo op. It's about the photo op with you guys. And that's a fact. So I'm gonna log off on some real shit at this event. By Reynoso, and that's it. I'm doing my post later on after the press comment, but you know it's whatever. But take care, everybody. Peace out.